I'm weird. I'm sorry. Deal with it. Um, anyway, I'm getting slap happy. It's getting late. Eh, not really. Um, but I thought I would start this video off with some show and tell because I have been telling you that I am working on completing projects that I have already begun before I start new ones. And you've probably seen these first two hanging behind me because now there's a terrible naked place there. Um, so first of all, we have this awesome green mandala. I love the green rhinestones. They're so beautiful. I wish I had a little bit more color to it, but again, this is the design. So, you know, you got to deal with what you deal with or what you're given, whatever. Anyway, turned out really pretty, nice and sparkly. Next, we have our beautiful baby Jesus. Look at that. So amazing. As I was working on this, I was really worried <clears throat> because the colors were so weird. But look at that gorgeous wood grain effect that you get. And even with the animals, I was not happy with the color choices that I was given. Um, but I went ahead and went with it. The only thing that I changed was I put sparklers in place of the white for the stars. So they literally sparkle a lot more with color. And then I had these blue um, drills from previous craft ventures. So they are a little bit bigger than the normal drill is, but I still, I made it work. I just smushed them in there. And then I had little blue metallic ones that I put right above his face. I also gave him a gold halo in his hair and I changed the skin tone a little bit because they gave me orange. I mean, he looked like would have looked like an Oompa Loompa. And still, it's really not the right shade, but it's better. Um, and once you get back from it, it works. Also, I put white AB drills for the top of his blanket where the light is shining down on him. So the blanket sparkles even more with the AB. There you can kind of see it. So you can see that the rest of the blanket is in shadow, but what is, you know, and also this right here, the little shiny um, aura, I guess you could call it. I wanted this black. Gotta love when that happens. I wanted this black, um, oh, that's just an extra drill, huh? It didn't even come off of a spot. It was just extra on top, There's cat hair and fuzz on it. But I wanted, I didn't want the black there in the sky, but I did not have enough of these navy blue to fill in. So I just kind of left some of the black in there. So maybe it's a, a shrub or something else or a cow outside. I don't know. But anyway, it looks amazing. I was really worried when I got it, but I'm very happy with the shading and the coloring. It's beautiful. Really turned out nice. So this is the first actual nativity of painting that I have done. I've got a bunch of others that I'm really unhappy with, so I haven't done them yet. But I wanted to get this one. Um, this is one of those that came in the mail and I started working on it almost immediately because I wanted to do the sparklers and the AB in the, the blanket and, and the stars. So I'm happy. So since I already had my AB drills out, I went ahead and started him. Now I did this last year and I gave it to my sister and I loved it so much. Um, I had to get myself one. So this is actually um, the second one of these I had done. The first one I actually did while my mom was recovering from her open heart surgery. So 
this kind of has you know a little bit extra meaning to it if you want to say because you know, you wish on a star and we got what we wished for so I wanted one for myself and I did swap out the white white area for a B's which you cannot tell but you can see the sparkle there it is a partial but I still love it I love the cardinal is there with the star and the snowman it's just a beautiful I love this imagery so much so I had to do one for myself <clears throat> and as you can guess it was really quick it didn't take me very long at all okay and then this one you've not seen at all because it came in the mail I opened it up and I sat down and I worked on it I, I had to do it in, in two days though because I had to get up and leave but you can see there are still wrinkles from the mail it has not flattened out yet but look at this it is gorgeous now the brown there is brown instead of black on the bee but i kept it because it was rhinestone and the rest of the painting is rhinestone and it is awesome there are the tiny they're not tiny they're the normal drill size a b crystals that i showed you in a previous video you can see them there how nice they look, but isn't this pretty? I love, this is another one I would love to find. Oh, I need to turn my ceiling fan off. It's making the little hairs pickle my face. Um, I would love to do this in a full drill and maybe just a smidgen bigger, but I love this so much. It is so pretty. I don't know, this, this might be prettier than doing it a full drill. Anyway, so there's that one. And then the last two show and tells. Mm -hmm. So happy. These are others that I altered with AB drills that I ordered from Tina. Diamond painting with sparklers. Look. Look. <laughs> so we have the new Grinch. Look at that. So I swapped out some of the greens on his face for ABs. I have three different colors of green that I just kind of mixed, um, matched as close as I could to the actual DMC number and did his face in ABs and then the rest is just normal drills. Same with Max, he's just normal drills. But I wanted the Grinch to stand out a little bit more and I love it. Plus, we all know green is one of my favorite colors, so this is just so adorable. So I um, I ordered a case of, 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 of 11 by 14 frames from Dollar Tree, and I'm still waiting on them. So I can't wait to get these guys framed and get them up on the wall because they are being bombarded with cat hair. So this is the second one. And again, same thing. I used the AB drills for his face only. And then regular drills for the rest of the painting. He's so cute. I like it. I should have at, fixed his mouth a little bit more, made it more visible. Uh, afterthought, you know. So there he is. Super cute. I love it. I love the background with the shading and the gradation. Grady, Grady. Yeah, that. But I love it. I'm very happy with them. Okay, now. <clears throat> excuse me a minute. I, sorry, my. Mom just messaged me. My dad got a good checkup. Yay. He has just been diagnosed with COPD, but it's very mild. So the pulmonologist is not too terribly concerned, which is a good thing. Because that's the last thing we need to worry about. Dad having to be on oxygen because he's a very active man. He would not be happy if he had to carry around oxygen everywhere he went. 
He would not like it one little bit. He gets mad when he has to do it, when he used to have to do like the halter monitor and stuff. It's like, Dad, it's overnight. It won't kill you. Oh, it's in my way. Okay, so this painting. I love him. I was worried he was going to show up because he took forever, it felt like, <clears throat> to get to me. But isn't he fun? So he will definitely have um, either probably rhinestones on his nose. I was going to say either ABs or rhinestones, but I'm thinking rhinestones on his nose because he's Rudolph. Hello. And this is 23 colors, 30 by 40. And the drills are here. And we'll skip this part because what you see on the canvas is what you get. Browns and reds, a little bit of pink there. Not too much of a surprise. This next canvas, so in love with. And I'm really proud of myself for the restraint I have shown for not doing this, which after I do this video, I will probably put it over there on my desk and break my own rule because I'm so excited to finally have this one. I have seen it on the little purses and I have seen it on the books. And this is the first time I have seen it on a canvas and it's special drill. Super, super happy. Look at how cute. Look at the hat. I mean, oh, I am in love so much with that canvas. Now, for the drills, we have 12 different ones, and we will see what they have done. Oh, yes! It's black rhinestones. Now, they are pretty opaque. There's really not much light going through them. But if you look real close, you can see that they're actually rhinestones. I was so hoping that it would be rhinestones for the hat and not just regular black drills. Because to me, that takes away from the rest of it if you've got all these beautiful rhinestones and then black drills. So we also have gray or like it's like a, a cross between brown and gray it's a really cool like hard to describe color this is a gorgeous look at that that is so pretty i bet that's for his nose number 10 is c yes that's his nose and the center of the poinsettia on the hat and then we have two shades of green i love this chartreuse green it's so cool then we have like a fuchsia, really bright pinkish red. We have our typical crystal there. Then we have our typical blue, which are, that's the outline for him. So I might, I might, I don't know. I just, I really hate these a lot. These and the white pearl ones. I have to use the plastic tips because if I don't, the metal tip like screeches. <gasps> Makes my tooth hurt. Can't stand it. So there we have two sizes of the AB marquee for the snowflakes scattered about. These are also another favorite of mine. These little like star shaped rounds. They have um, a really cool texture. And then we have the beautiful red marquee. So there we have it. My little friend who's patiently been waiting piled up under a mound of paintings being flattened. So this is beautiful. So happy. This is another one that makes me happy because I love this image and I've only seen partials. It's only just been her tail. I didn't want that. I wanted a full drill. So I've been waiting and looking and waiting and looking and then I came across this one. I was like, yes. It's a special drill 
which is kind of weird looking when you look at the way they've done it. But I'm excited because I really like her a lot. And I like that you still get all the detail in the actual painting. And even better, it's going to have rhinestones. So oh, I had to get her. So there are 12 different <clears throat> stones for her. And yes. So let's take a peek at her stones. My mother is bothering me. Can you hear the phone? Beep, 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 beep. Anyway, so moving on. She doesn't watch my videos, I don't have to worry. No watch, this will be the one she watches. She'll be like, excuse me? I was doing what? She didn't. She laughed. All right, so this is really weird. I have three little bags. Look at the size of those. Those are huge. Where the heck did the... Oh, those go in the water. So maybe that's supposed to be like reflection in the water. Those are huge. Gigantic. Those are really big. Kind of obnoxious. Then we have little baby champagne-colored marquees. And then we have regular crystal rounds. And then we have the rest are normal rhinestones. So we have yellow, this awesome, I love this orangish red color. And then this is a fun color also, the champagne peach color. Then we have standard crystal, which I will hopefully be able to swap out to AB crystal, which will be better. Then we have three shades of blue here. And then purple and magenta, which I'm guessing is for her hair. Better be. So this is going to be a really neat painting when it's done. I'm, I'm happy happy to see how it turns out. It's just weird how it's, I guess those were just leftovers from a previous packaging event. I don't know. Who knows? As long as they're what they're supposed to be. And I, they have different number on them. Do they? 137? Oh no, they don't. No. Okay. So there's that. And then last but not least on this, I did it. I broke down and I did it. I shouldn't have because I know it's not big enough. But in the scheme of things, and given my lack of wall space, so I know I shouldn't have, but I did it anyway because it was less than $5. And when you get back from it, you can tell who they are. It's just up close. They're really creepy because they have like the singular drill black eye. So it's still, I love this. I don't have, I really, y'all know, I've, we've talked about this before. I do not have the patience for the giant paintings. I've probably got a dozen of them hanging in my closet. And I just haven't done them because... They're just too big. So this is, I think, 40 by 50. It doesn't say. I, if I can remember, it's 40 by 50. But it was $5. I was like, <laughs> even if it's crappy for $5, I mean. So, yeah, 49 30 30 by 31 by 50. It's funny. 31 by 49. But I don't care. It's cute. It's my princesses. I love them. I know who they are. I don't know if I'll ever frame it. May not. Might. I don't know. But yeah. So that is that. And there are only 18 colors, which again tells me that it won't be spectacular. But it is packaged nicely, and it does have DNC codes. Okay, the next things I want to share with you 
our fun little stickers that I've been hanging on to for a while to share with you. So we have little cactus guys. I think they need googly eyes. What do you think? They would be really fun with googly eyes. Just turn them into little kawaii cactuses. Why not? So they have, even though they're such a tiny amount of drills, we still have our nice packaging. In terms of the standard toolkit, of course. So those are adorable. Less than $3 I paid for those. Did you notice the light in the background it's going on and off? Yeah. Emily was like, ah, act scared like you don't know what's going on. She's such a weirdo. Everything's got to be scary. raining even harder now and the rain is like hitting the window and I keep hearing the little click 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 of the rain hitting the window it's annoying me do you have that problem little like repetitive sounds are like really aggravating. there's actually a diagnosis for that it's kind of dumb but it's just it's just like one of those like auditory irritations okay so this next one is the little keychains which we have talked about before will end up being ornaments. So when I saw these Christmas ornaments, um, I said, Oh, I have to get these because they're actually Christmas themed. So we have a little snowman stocking. Isn't he cute? You see his little face there in the middle of his giant nose. We have a beautiful traditional round ornament reminds me of frozen because it's blue and swirly. Let it go, let it go. Still haven't seen the new movie. Cannot wait. Getting really anxious for it to come out on DVD since I did not get to go see it in the theater because we were traveling and then just, I don't even know why we didn't get there. We had a couple of times where we were had planned and something happened that we didn't get to go and I cannot remember now why. And then we have packages. The little bells I'm not fond of, but I might spruce them up with, I don't know. I don't know what, but I don't, I don't like them as much, but they are the nice acrylic. They're not the real flimsy ones. So I was happy with that. And they have a good, the good metallic packaging, even though there aren't um, DNC codes on the rhinestones but it's still that blue metallic packaging. So we have, ooh, I like those. Those are just a blue crystally marquee. Then we have our big red circles. We have our big gold circles. These are the blue AB, blue, purple, depends on how you look at them. And then we have our red teardrops with the AB on them. And then the regular rhinestones, we have the cool yellow. This yellow, I don't know what they do to it, but it just, I don't know, it's so much different. I guess it's just the color that they use, but I love it. It's my favorite. And this really deep purple, I love. We have black rhinestones there. And the reason you know they're rhinestones is because they have the silver back. So that lets you know that it's a clear piece over that. We have our standard crystal green, pink, red, deep yellow, and then a really pretty blue. So we have some good, good, good colors in this kit. Very nice. Very, very nice. <clears throat> I have, I really have to get moving on my special rhinestone, special, <laughs> this style of painting because my drawer, I have one drawer that I put all of the special stone drills in and it's really full. So 
so I need to get, a, I have a couple of books. I still haven't done those little purses. I need to get them done because they're taking up a lot of space. So I, now I have all these stickers to put in there. I've got to quit ordering. I just need to stop ordering because it's ridiculous. I'm, my, my six drawers right there, the five, oh, that one's crooked. The five bottom ones are full. The top drawer I am reserving for finished paintings that have not been framed because I don't want them to get messed up. So I have had to move on to different container to put drills in. And now it's almost full. This is a different boat. I might have to keep this one. It's prettier green. I like it. It's more opaque. It's this one. These other ones are more translucent, but I like that darker green. It's pretty. So here we have just regular drills and cute little emoji type stickers. Very girly for, can you guess who these are for? These will definitely be swapped over to rhinestones. They will not be regular drills. I will make them rhinestone stickers. Because, hello, can't just have normal stickers. If you're going to be diamond painting them. The really, you want to hear something really cool. I don't know if I mentioned this already, but her, for the cookies, they get prizes to pay based on what they sell. And one of the, early, one of the lowest, I don't want to say lowest prices, prizes, but it's one of the first tiers of prize is actually a set of diamond painting stickers, which I thought was very cool. And everyone is like, what is this? What is this? I'm like, dude, y'all, they're diamond painting stickers. And I'm like, oh, okay. Because they've seen my diamond paintings. A couple of them have gotten them as gifts and such. So, oh, this is in a different color even. I don't want any more boats. It's... Stop it, Margie. Stop it. I don't need it. Okay, so these are Christmas stickers. This one's super cute. There's a little bear sitting in the boot. Isn't that cute? And I like the little evergreen reindeer. He's adorable. These are rhinestones. Because whoever made this kit was smart. The rhinestones on stickers. Especially when you got girly kind of stickers. Come on. Oh, have to be rhinestones. Here. Rhinestones down. So here we have our standard crystal, which actually these are a little bit different. They're not the normal like silvery one. They're more clear, almost like ice. And then yellow and orange. Then we have blue. And now these go into the bigger ones. So these are a little bit bigger, pink. And then we have even bigger with the red circle. These are the orange AB, which we see a lot. Then we have the red teardrops, the green AB marquee, and then these are just the red, smaller red dots. So I like that there are so many different styles. Let me pick up the ones that fell in the floor on these stickers. So they will be extra cool. And then we have green, two shades of green, and our standard Christmas red. And then, last but not least, we have a couple crystal AB circles and, whoops, sorry, stars. So these are going to be really nice. And they will most likely show up on cards. Um, I probably won't turn them into ornaments just for the, um, I don't know. I don't know. I had to think about it, but they'll, pro they'll probably just be go on cards that I will send to special 
people that I know will not just toss them in the garbage. I've actually stopped sending out Christmas cards to a vast majority of people, mainly because I don't get them anymore. I get like maybe five, six Christmas cards. I used to, I used to get and send out like 50 to 60 cards every year and people just don't do it anymore. So I only send cards to the people that I know appreciate them. Um, super close family, friends that are also card makers <clears throat> because I will not buy cards just to send them. That's not going to happen. So these, you probably remember, I did these last year and I had to get myself a second set because they turned out so stinking cute. I had put uh, sparklers on their wings and changed out some of their outfits to ABs. So this time I want to do all rhinestones on them and I want to see how cute that is because they came with normal drills. So I want to swap them out and do all rhinestones. So I'm excited to see how that turns out. And their box really got mangled in the mail, but they are okay. So can you imagine what, what they would have looked like if they hadn't been in the box? If the box turned out like this? Ooh, scary stuff. So that is that for today. I will see y'all again real soon. Thank you for watching. I need to go lint roll myself because I have got so much hair, like loose hair. Mm, it's driving me crazy. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing and join us on Facebook. Check us out there. Um, yeah.